Welcome to the Reality Revolution. I'm your host, Brian Scott. I have a special meditation today. We have discussed previously the fact that we exist within a simulation and using NLP techniques and other vibrational techniques, I'm going to take you into the command center of the simulation. Within this command center, you can go and look at your current timeline. You can go to the past. You can rewind to the past. You can increase certain elements within the vibrational timeline. This gives you an interface into your reality to adjust it and modify it and change the course of your timeline. This gives you a different way of affecting your reality by looking at it like you're within a command center and you have with your higher self full access to the past, the present and the future. You can bring new elements into your simulation, love, health, wealth, greater spirituality, and a variety of additional possibilities. This is so much fun in a meditative space. You'll find it to be very powerful and transformative. If you do this on a regular basis over a 30 day period, you will find your reality changing into the dynamics that you set within your command center. So find a place to let go of the outside world. Sit down or lay down, whatever is more comfortable, but make your intention to become aware during this process, to become conscious and tuned in to my guidance. a few moments and center yourself, slowing down your breath. Breathe in through your nose and breathe out. Make it like a circle, breathing in through your nose. and out through your mouth. Smell the roses and blow out the candles. Continue this breathing pattern. If your mind goes astray, just come back to your breath for the next few moments. As you continue this slow breathing cycle, you bring your consciousness to your heart. This is the command center of the simulation. Within this space, you will find all access to the realities all around you. See your breath coming in through your heart and bring your focus and attention to your heart. Elevate an emotion to bring the energy to your heart. 
I like to focus on gratitude or love. I bring up an exciting emotion, but I bring it up in my heart. Breathing in and out in this slow pattern. Now to amplify the prana within your body, to take you into the command center of the simulation, I want you to to do alternate nostril breathing for a few moments. You can use your thumb and forefinger. You can choose left or right nostril. Breathe in through one nostril and out through the other. Breathing in through one nostril, out through the other. Then back in through that same nostril and then out through the other. Do this for a few more moments to increase the pranic activity within your body. Now just relax for a few moments. Let go of any tensions you're holding in your body that keep you locked within your physical matrix. See if you're tensing any muscles subconsciously, relaxing your feet and the soles of your feet, the tops of your feet and your toes. As you relax each portion of your body, you see light entering into your body raising your awareness. See the relaxation coming into your calves, your shins, your knees relax, your legs, your thighs, quads, hamstrings, and glutes all relaxing, letting go of any tension you might be holding feeling more relaxed than ever before. Let this relaxation spread up through your stomach, your lower back, through your hips, relaxing your chest and through your ribs to your back. Relax all the muscles in your neck, let down your shoulders. Relax your arms, keep your hands comfortable. Relax your forearms and your hands, your wrists, all the fingers, becoming more and more relaxed. Let this relaxation spread up through your neck, through your face, your forehead, back of your head, around your mouth and eyes, your tongue, just sit, in a deep state of meditative relaxation. As you do, you open up to the light all around you, feeling the many different geometric structures of light interacting within your energy body. You can see the Merkaba, 
spinning around you, your light body awakening, moving into perfect vibration. You can feel the energies moving up through the soles of your feet, coming up through the earth, up through your root chakra, your sacral, your solar plexus, your heart, your throat, into your brain, into your third eye, and crown chakra, up into the upper chakras above your head and below your feet, the earth chakra, the space chakra all around. See these energies coming down from the center of this galaxy, in streaming down through your crown, your third eye, in through your throat, in through your heart, down through your solar plexus, your sacral chakra, into your root, at your perineum, and down through your feet. Now, you can feel the energies moving up your body and down your body. It is important to become aware of these energies as they move through each of your energy centers, awakening, balancing, and amplifying each of these energy centers, resolving all blockages from your current life for a variety of reasons. Let the light shine through each of these energy centers. Sit in perfect balance. Let the prana flow. In order to enter into the command center, we need to raise our vibration and tune into our higher self. We now make it our intention. I now intend to tune in to my higher self at the highest vibrational level, to gain full administrative access to the simulation. Above your head, you begin to feel a powerful white ball of light. This is the higher self entering into this density through this meditation and below your feet you can feel your ego self your small self your individualized identity within third density that carries all of the personality structures of your ego and who you are Now see this black ball, this egoic structure moving up through the body, up into the white ball of light above you. See them meld together. Sit for a few moments as you see that personality structure dissolving as white light enters it and the template of the higher self slowly grafts itself onto this black ball of the ego until there is nothing left but a bright white light now you can see this bright white light split off from the higher self, remaining white and moving down through the body, down below your feet. Sitting in the vibration of your higher self in this moment. Become aware of the energies around you and see yourself moving outside of your body.
Perhaps you can look down at your apartment, house, wherever you are, look down upon yourself and see your living establishment getting smaller and smaller as you rise above and look at the city or town where you live. You can see it getting smaller and smaller. You move higher and higher into the sky, high above the clouds, into the atmosphere, out up above the earth, looking down at the earth until the earth gets smaller and smaller. Moving backwards, outwards, forwards, into infinity. How far can you go? Moving faster and faster, you move beyond the solar system, beyond the galaxy, beyond the universe, into the blackness beyond, and sit within the infinite void beyond all things. How far into this infinite void can you go? Within this vast void, you see a single pinprick of light. You focus your consciousness upon it, and this light grows. You move closer and closer to this light, and moving outward into this light, it grows and grows, and you begin to see a huge building. It will look differently to everybody as their consciousness allows them to interpret it. You enter in through the door and see a vast room of monitors, a command center. Everybody is watching your life. Upon the monitors, you see different parts of your life, different things that have happened in your life running by as if they are happening now. You see events happening in your future. You see other related events happening, all on different monitors within your current timeline. Everybody turns to see you, and there you see your higher self. You walk up to your higher self, you embrace and thank your higher self for all that they have done. You fuse into the knowledge of the higher self, entering into every pore, every neuron, every synaptic connection within your mind. You feel a great knowing and light entering into every portion of your vessel. After this fusion, you come apart. You have a clear understanding of every aspect of this command center. And before you, you see a complete control panel. You can rewind your current life upon the screen into the past to any point in the past. You can fast forward to any point in the future. And you can make modifications and adjustments 
You can change things that have happened in the past or you can change what happens in the future. Upon the control board, you can see a number of elements that you can increase with dials. Perhaps it looks like an equalizer where you can increase or decrease any of the levels that you wish with additional opportunities for input. You can increase the love by increasing the dial. You can decrease the anger. If there's a depression dial, you can decrease it. You can increase the wealth. You can increase your health. You can click on any of the dials and an entire portion of information will come up for you where you can get more and more specific as to any particular aspect of your simulation. For this is the command center of the simulation. Here you can program the simulation in whatever fashion that you want. You can look at all the possibilities available to you. You can run simulations within the simulation to see different exciting possibilities that are available to you. So we will begin by going in to the command center and looking at your past. You can rewind to any portion in your past and you can change any element of your past. Spend a few moments going back and adjusting all of the different elements within your past in whatever manner you wish as this is nothing more than a simulation. Now, you can fast forward into your future and look at any potentials that are available to you on your timeline. Perhaps you want to be a writer. You can go and seek out in the simulation the best version of you that's a writer. Perhaps you want to be a musician. Perhaps you want to be an engineer. Whatever you wish within this timeline, you can search out using this simulation through the conscious intention of your mind you can guide it to whatever portion you wish. Using the command center functions, find the perfect potential timeline for you for whatever it is that you desire.
Now you can change specific elements within your simulation. To begin, we will go into the love aspect for your timeline in the ways that you've learned the lessons of love and the relationships that you have in every facet. Explore this level of your simulation now. Making any needed adjustments and gaining any information that you may require. Now, enter into the wealth aspect of your simulation. See what lessons you need to learn, and what potentials are available to you on this timeline. Opportunities to utilize wealth for service or experiences that you might have. All the different aspects of it. This may require going back in to the past or exploring different versions of the future. You are the programmer and you have all the control to program the simulation in whatever manner you want within the command center with your higher self. Explore all versions of wealth within your timeline in the simulation now.
now explore all elements of health on your timeline. Any health problems that you might have in the future or in the past. Any healing that you might need or healing for others, abilities to heal others, whatever facet it is within the healing life principle as it interacts with you in the simulation. Go in and program your simulation in whatever manner you need to improve your health and provide the lessons that you need as you interact within this simulation. Changing any pre-incarnational programming if needed. You're at the core base of the programming structure of the simulation. Now, make any other adjustments to any aspect of your life, on any level, friendships, experiences that you'd like to have, whatever it is, you can make whatever adjustments that you want to make in the simulation or explore any potentials or gain any information within the command center.
now. Take a moment to communicate with your higher self, asking any questions or gaining any information that you might need from your higher self who knows all possibilities in every reality and is you in the future. Now thank your higher self and thank all the people and entities that are within your command center, thanking them, blessing them. You depart from the command center looking back at this beautiful building in which they program the simulation, seeing it shrink in size, you're back through the void. Moving through the void, you enter back into the universe, seeing the stars and galaxies moving towards the Milky Way galaxy, closing in on our solar system, moving towards the Earth, moving back down, down through the atmosphere to your town or city back into your living establishment, your house or apartment, wherever you're at, back into your room where you're meditating, come back to yourself, feeling complete and whole, and spend a few moments assimilating the information that you've gained and allowing for the new changes in the simulation to take effect.
but go out into the day. Or, if you choose to, go into a deep sleep in which your dreams inspire you to greater levels of information about your simulation and the experiences of your life. Welcome to the Reality Revolution 